it's Danny and today I'm going to be showing you how to draw apple blossom. So, if you guys know, I really, really, really love Shopkins and they're fun to draw too. So, today I thought I should show you guys how to draw one of my favorite Shopkins, which is apple blossom. So, let's get started. So first we're going to start off with her body and I just have a lid to my, one of my slime containers and if you can draw a perfect circle that's fine you don't have to use this but I'm not very good at drawing perfect circles so I'm going to use this so yeah so I'm using a sharpie but you don't have to use a sharpie if you're not very good at drawing, like, if you're not that good at drawing, you need help drawing, or you make mistakes when you draw, I suggest to use a pencil so that way you don't make a mistake using a Sharpie and then you can't use the back side because there's sharpie on the back and you're just wasting paper because you're making a whole bunch of mistakes so unless you really nailed it and, drew, and know how to draw it i suggest using a pencil for now i had to use a pencil when i learned how to draw this because i kept messing up and it was just it was a big disaster but now that I've drawn it a whole bunch of times, I'm used to it now. So all I'm doing is taking a spool of yarn, which you don't have to use, but I'm gonna use it, and I'm gonna use it for the eyes. And again, if what I said, if you know how to draw perfect circles, you go ahead and draw your perfect circles. While I'm gonna be over here using things to trace out my circles because I'm an unperfect circle uh -uh. so now we're going to draw the eyelashes and how to draw the eyelashes is you're just going to draw one line up at the top and then two lines down at the bottom just like that oh we forgot something else we forgot to make it look like actual eyes instead of just big circles with eyelashes so you're gonna draw one circle at the top and then one circle at the bottom and the circle at the top is bigger than the one at the bottom like that then you're just gonna color in the rest of the white part inside your eye There you go. Okay. So now we're going to draw her smile. So to draw her smile, all you're going to want to do is draw a regular smile like usual. And then draw another smile on top, just like that. And then do a little curve inside for the tongue. And then you do a little s curve on the side. And she just has it on one side. It's pretty strange that she doesn't have it on two. But she has it on one side only. So I think it's kind of strange. Now we're going to draw her shoes. So to draw her shoes, I make it easy by drawing a little line down and then I go curve and then curve to get Shopkin shoes and then she has little bows on and I'm not a very good bow drawler either so if you're a good bow drawler go ahead and draw your perfect bow this as good as I can get it so now we're gonna draw her stem, her little worm, her flowers, and her leaves at the top. 
So let's zoom in and let's go up to the top. Okay. So we're going to start with her stem. And to draw her stem, you're going to want to draw one big line curved that way. And then a smaller line curved the same way. So then from the top of the smaller line, you're going to go all the way across. And then from the top of the big line, you're going to go across as well and add on. So it's like that. Now we're going to draw the leaves. So the first leaf is going to go like right in the middle of the stem. And it's going to curve. And then at the end of the stem is where it's going to end. And then you draw two little lines inside. Then the second leaf starts from the end of the stem and kind of ends... Um, almost like if you start from the eye and you go all the way up, it ends right there. So, yeah. Then you're going to draw a little the little flower. And the flower only has four petals. So all you got to do is that, really. And then her little worm, all you got to do is draw a little base for the worm and then you go up and then you curve for his head and you go in a little bit and then you go down and then you just go like that and then you draw her little smile and her eyes and like that now all we gotta do is draw her hands and we're finished so her first hand is touching her eye. So how you do that really is you go like that and then you go like that. And it doesn't go, this side doesn't go all the way across. It like stays out a little bit. So now we're gonna draw her second hand. Her second hand has a lot of detail. So that's why I'm zooming in. So she's holding a flower. So how to do this one is you go like that and you curve it and then you go like that. Now we're gonna draw the flower and all you gotta really do is go like that and you draw a little line down at the bottom and the exact same thing, four little petals. And you're done. And that's Apple Blossom. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'll see you next time. Bye.